Hey guys, I'm back for another unboxing. I'm here at Australian Piano Warehouse and this time I'm gonna be unboxing this, which is a pedal extender. I've never used one of these before. Let's check it out. All right, so this pedal extender is from a company called Music Bumblebees, uh, which is an Australian company. Uh, we've got a little, uh, little extra little promo card in here. And I can now see the keys, uh, sorry, the pedals um, on the top here. See that? There are our, our two pedals that is going to be raised up on the box. So let's grab this out. <clears throat> okay, so having a closer look at it, let's uh, take off the outsides here. And do an unwrap. <clears throat> Aha, looks nice. There we go. So it's got some instructions with it about how to actually put it in the right spot. So we're going to try that out on this piano in just a moment. Uh, it also comes with a little, this is like a cleaning cloth. Oh no, it must be, oh they're little, uh, I think there's a little pedal booties to go over the, or maybe you put them over the ones on the actual piano. I'll have to read the instructions. But there you go, this is how it actually looks. You can see it's got um, adjustable height, which of course is really, really important for uh, the students we're teaching and the ability to change that. Um, and underneath, I mean, it's a pretty simple construction really. You've got, it's very much like a piano bench, um, a kind of scissor mechanism here with the screws, uh, and then the underside of the pedals, uh, which are adjustable in height to suit how high your piano's uh, off the ground. So let's get down on the ground and see if we can uh, fit this to this piano. Okay, so here we are um, underneath the piano having a look at the pedals uh, and uh, what you need to do is uh, slide it over so that it's in, the, in position and that was, uh, that was actually dead easy. Um, it actually uh, has stoppers against the back of the piano here so it's, you can tell that it's in the right position. Um, and I can now just adjust the, uh, the underside of these pedals where it meets the actual piano pedals just so they're touching so there's not a gap before the, the child presses and has the same effect. Um, and I can do the same on this side. It actually looks like just out of the box, it's in about the right position um, anyway. So let me show you exactly how it's working. So here you can see exactly how the pedal extender works. We've got the real piano pedal, the gold, right on the bottom here. And then this is the adjustment knob, which is pushing this pad on top of the pedal there. And you can see if I push the pedal on the top, it simply mirrors the movement down below. And so you can obviously adjust and fine tune that as you need to, because there's still a little bit of motion here before it, uh, it actually affects the pedal. So we'd want to adjust that um, out of it. Now clearly I'm not someone that actually needs a pedal extender, but uh, I thought we should actually test it out and see what it would be like for a child. I mean, it's incredibly stable. There's no doubt about that. It's not moving forward or back. There's no rocking motion. It's really stable for a child. Really easy to use. And I think the, the only kind of downside I could see um, in a device like this is that if you do want to keep changing it for different students that come into your lessons, uh, when you do uh, adjust it up and down, which is dead easy, uh, and it does go quite high, the only problem is that as you adjust it up and down, you've also got to adjust the contact with the pedals um, underneath. Now it's very easy, I'll show you here how that works. So as you, lift, as you lift this up, you'll need to um, loosen this screw here. And then you can see just how much movement you've got in this. I mean, it can go really high. Um, so there's no problem with doing that, but you would want to kind of set this up for a range of children so you don't have to adjust it every single time. Um, but that's it. That's the... Music Bumblebee's pedal extender, I have to say I'm pretty impressed, dead easy to set up, literally I took it out of the box, slid it on the piano, tiny adjustment, ready to go for whatever student you want to use. So let me know if you've got any questions on that or if you've tried out any other different pedal extenders, um, love to hear your thoughts. Have you subscribed to this YouTube channel yet? 
If not, make sure you click the link on this page to do so. And while you're about it, make sure you check out our other links to other videos and also to my blog where I've got lots and lots of great articles and videos and teaching manuals and lesson plans to help you in your teaching studio. Have fun.